Mac is 101 here today. This is a brief tutorial on how to FTP to your website. Um, first of all, you have to download something called Cyberduck, or you can do this through Finder. But um, Cyberduck makes it a lot easier because when you do it with Finder, you have a lot of problems. So I have a download or a link in the description to download um, Cyberduck, and you can also just do this with Finder. So I'll open Cyberduck. Okay, so we're Cyberduck. Um, now I can click Open Connection right up here. This little button right there. Uh, I'll just click that, and then the information you're gonna want to fill in is um server right here. That's just the name of your website. So I'm gonna be connecting to MacHeads101.com. Most of this stuff you want to leave to be normal. I'm gonna type our username. Okay, and our password. Okay. Right. And I'm gonna check add to keychain, so no, I'm not gonna check add to keychain. That means that it remembers your password. So you don't need the www dot server. Um and then you wanna click connect right here. You can just see how I filled out this information. I'll click connect. And now it'll open up what's on your website pretty quickly. So um, you can go up to the action button and you can click upload, new folder, new file. So um, you can either do the uploading this way or you can drag and drop. I'll just drag and drop. So I'll upload um, this folder. You can upload folders and files. That's one of the reasons it's so nice. Okay, now you'll see my folder here. You can just open it up to see what's inside or double click it to just make the whole screen that. And then you can drag a file in to add it right here. You can also download one of these by clicking the icon right here and dragging it onto your desktop. I prefer to drag it onto my desktop. You can do whatever. So here it is on my desktop. Um, so it'll just drag it right onto your desktop. You can edit it, then drag it back up here. When you try to replace something, it'll ask you before you replace it. I'm not going to even bother replacing it. So, But that's pretty cool. It's it's very um, useful to be able to do this. Um, you can use this to go back around and around. Um, you can also do a quick connect, so I'll just type, it'll ask you for your username and password. Mine happens to be, be simple. And then it'll just automatically connect you. Okay, so that's how to use Cyberduck. Now, let's use Finder. We all love the Finder interface. Now we're going to go up to um, the Go menu. Then click Connect to Server. And then we want to type FTP colon slash slash. And then your host, probably mine is MacEdgeOne.com. Then you click Connect. I will click Allow. And now um, it will automatically come up like this because I've already entered my password. Um, you will have to enter your password separately. Um, let's click open. So then you can read and write files. You can easily download them. Okay. The only issue with this is that you can only read. Um, so you can't write to things. Okay, so that's how you can do it with Finder. This is only read. You cannot drag to upload. You really have no choice except to download Cyberduck, so um, I might consider downloading it. There are other things that Apple has made, like Classic FTP, um, which I, 
I happen to have, but it's not as good as Cyberduck. Cyberduck is like the number one simple FTP software. So um, thanks for watching and uh, goodbye.